Will hello and welcome to Stop Let's Team Up My Legion Adventure episode 29 and we're taking a little sidebar away from um, Adventure Comics and we're going to be talking about an issue of a story that was in an issue of Jimmy Superman's pal Jimmy Olsen number 72 let me give you some pertinent data and then I'll tell you what I thought about it uh, it was cover it's Superman's pal Jimmy Olsen volume 1 number 72 uh Cover date, October 1963. Cover artist, Kurt Swan, George Klein. Woohoo! Uh, the name of the story is The World of the Doomed Olsons, and it is writer Jerry Siegel, penciler Kurt Swan, inker George Klein. Uh, this is just a nine-page uh, nine little ditty. I'm going to give you the, the synopsis from the DC database. Jimmy is taking part in a televised showcase of... His many adventures, focusing particularly on the formula that turns him into Elastic Lad and his various transformations over the years. His special is suddenly interrupted by an alien creature calling itself the Collector, who kidnaps Jimmy with his scientific devices. Jimmy finds himself transported to an alien world where the Collector hopes to make a collection of all the various incarnations of Jimmy Olsen. Rooting Jimmy to the ground by literally turning his feet to tree roots, the Collector keeps Superman at bay as well and apparently brings forth the giant monster Jimmy, um, the Wolfman Jimmy, the Porcupine Jimmy, the Fat Jimmy, and the Real Jimmy. These alternate versions of him terrorize him before they themselves are rooted to the ground. Before the Collector can do anything else, Jimmy suddenly pulls the microphone that had been attached to him since the TV interview and throws it at the Collector, scaring the creature, thus proving to Jimmy that it's a ruse, which was... Jimmy has deduced that the Collector is really mon in disguise due to his reaction to the microphone, which had was made with some lead parts, which used to be a weakness of mon and that the other Jimmys are really members of the Legion of Superheroes, who are revealed by Colossal Boy to be Colossal Boy, Chameleon Boy, and his new pet Prody 2, Cosmic Boy, and Bouncing Boy. Jimmy learns this was all planned by the Legion and Superman as an initiation for Jimmy, who was taken to the 30th century and awarded with an honorary membership in the Legion of Superheroes. So, let's, uh, Jim, Jimmy's the main character, supporting cast Superman, antagonist the Collector, and Legion Roll Call, Cosmic Boy, Chameleon Boy, Colossal Boy, Bouncing Boy, mon um, and then cameos by Saturn Girl, Lightning Lad, Triplica Girl, Trinking Violet, Brainiac 5, Sun Boy, Fire Lad, Night Girl, and Polar Boy from the League of Substitute Heroes, and the introduction of Prody 2, who in the last issue we covered uh, in Adventure Comics, um, the Prody 1 sacrificed himself to bring Lightning Lad back together. Okay, before I read, read it today, and uh, I had read it a couple days ago too, uh, I thought... Uh, I had never read this one before. I think I have in either a collection or something. Because I, I just... I forgot it was a Jimmy Olsen story and not a Legion story. Because it's a, the Legion's in it and it's got gorgeous Kurt Swan, George Klein um, imagery. It's a fun comic. It's a really fun comic. It's one of those little... See, I didn't read a lot of Jimmy Olsen or Lois Lane comics. And, uh, and some the few Lois Lane comics I've read, they're really kind of dated and i don't think they really they just have never caught on with me but this jimmy olsen story it's just a cute little fun story and i've heard of all these the famous jimmy olsen stories where he's elastic lad he's the giant turtle boy he's the werewolf um he's a porcupine i forgot about miss glizzlepuzz uh if i'm pronouncing the glizzlepuzz uh the the lady imp who uh because i've never read the porcupine story um but, I mean, the art's gorgeous. Um, it's just when he's meeting all the different Jimmies, it's just little quick gags, like the turtle person almost steps on him. The quill shooting one, you know, he's he just misses. Um, the, the fat, which is kind of problematic nowadays, but, you know, he's eating apples and getting bigger and bigger. Um, and then the elastic one tickles him, and it finds out... Um, you know, and the collector's a great design. It's a great Kurt Swan design. He's kind of like a devil um, in a one-piece men's bathing suit and some gauntlets. But it's a neat character. It's a, it, I mean, it's Kurt Swan. Um, and I love Kurt Swan, George Klein, Superman. And I, I mean, his love is Legion, too. They're Legion, too. 
But of course, because Jimmy's the hero of the story, he figures it out. It's something so simple. Um, and then they're all unveiled. And you see what the Legion's going to look like in a few years uh, after Joe Forte leaves and Kurt Swan and, uh, becomes the main penciler of it for a big chunk of that. But um, I really, really like it. And, you know, I mean, I just think it's a lot of fun. Um, and it's worth a read. It's worth a read. If you're going to do your journey through the Legion, this stop and read this one. This one's in the archives, so I read it. Um, and it is listed on this one website that I found that has been helpful with do I, do I not. And more times than not, it's a do not. They're just, it's just too much of a cameo. The next issue is the next issue of adventure, but the, the, um, the, the change in this one is it's not, um, a Superboy story, but it's a Supergirl story. And it is art by, um, let me see, is it? Yes, it's Swan. Uh, it's a Swan Supergirl in the Legion, but it's a Legion story, not a Superboy. You know, it's the Legion story that month is a Supergirl one. So I'm looking forward to that. So do check out um, Jimmy Olsen, number 72. Um, I read it in the book, but I'm going to pause for a second. And then I'm going to see if it's available in the app because I didn't even try to read it on the app. Thanks for giving me that second to go check. And no, uh, on the app, it has the first eight issues of the original of Jimmy Olsen, Superman's pal Jimmy Olsen. Um, and then it jumps to 133 when Kirby takes over. And it has the Kirby stuff, including the two Don Rickles. Oh, Giant Size Jimmy Olsen's pal 140 has this story in it. So um, go check it out. It's worth a read. It is a lot, a lot of fun. Um... I may read this just because it's got some probably some Superman stories I've never read and there's some good Kurt Swan in there i be looking forward to it. so that's it for this week Thursday we'll be doing our next Defenders as we get closer to the Avengers Defenders War which I'm excited about doing uh, I don't know what I'm doing for this Saturday show I'm maybe I'll be able to I'll be ready to do the one about Lynn Wine it's just you know busy work stuff um, this one I'm glad this was a short one because it was a short read and it was easy to discuss and I hope you like the reviews. Please um, uh, give us a, a review on your podcasting uh, platform of choice. Apple would be nice because that kind of helps with the numbers. I'd like to get more people to listen and interested. I know these are just quickie little throwaways, but that's kind of why I'm, what I'm hoping you like. Tell me what you like. Tell me what you don't like. Um, tell me if there's a book you want to do. I've got some friends I'm trying to get time to set up, and we're going to talk Thunderbolts and, an X, and another guy. We're going to talk an X-Men comic. I'm excited about that. Uh, a team that I may not have read. You know, at one point I want to do some uh, New Warriors because I've never read it. Um, and I really got an inch into do Secret Six. Uh, just been thinking about it recently, so kind of thinking about doing that. So, I mean, that's it for this week. Hey, one more thing. I got an idea. Uh, I haven't done it. I'm going to do Lin Wine. He's going to be the first person I would do. Uh, think of someone else you would like uh, and, you know, post it on and or send me a message of some creator, obscure or not, that you think, you know, you'd like to know more about, or you want to hear my opinion on or whatever. Uh just let me know. I'm open to suggestions to any books I should cover, any issues I should cover. Just let me know. Uh, I appreciate input. But until then, folks, you know, be smart, be safe, be kind, and read some comics.